it's Chippy here from umpcportal.com and I just quickly wanted to show you how I've got the um, Lenovo Mix 210 set up today. It's quite an interesting setup because I've got an external USB 3 connectivity dock. So this is the Belkin USB 3 dock. There's USB out, there's a uh, USB audio port in there. There's a USB, um, well there's about four USB ports on there, two of which are USB 3. Uh, we have power in. There's a USB 3 connector that goes to the Lenovo and DV out. There's a DP port, a display port in the back there as well, and a gig E if I needed it. So the reason it's quite interesting is that normally you'd actually have the tablet in here, and I've used this with uh, Windows 8 in 8 inch tablets. Um, but because the Lenovo has this docking station, what you can do is have what's what I would call a no cable docking solution. So We've got this extended up to a 1080p screen here and connected through, of course, the USB 2 connector here. Now, that's pretty transparent. Unless you're doing video or gaming, that's pretty transparent. You can actually use that pretty nicely. Um, but all you need to do is just pull that out and the screen goes away. Obviously, I lose the connected USB ports here, but that just uh, comes back as a single screen solution um here um now all i have to do to just get that back is live demo drop that back on there and you should see that uh reconnect up oops i just didn't put that down properly so you can hear everything reconnecting over usb you can see my monitor's just fired up it takes a few seconds to actually warm up this monitor it's an old one it's just recognized as a DVI port there. And there we go, extended screen. Just get that back in focus. So that's a really nice way to ignore this bit at the back. This is just a, a monitor stand. A really nice way to do a no cable docking solution with the Lenovo Mix 10.2. Uh, of course, the power plug is actually on the tablet itself. So if you've got power connected, um, you'll have to disconnect that um, before you um, disconnect the uh well before you take the tablet away and i will say that charging uh, is pretty slow on this device as well and um, it will charge slowly as you use it uh, but it's recommended for for uh, the fastest sort of charge to to actually take the tablet out and turn it off charge it overnight otherwise it's going to take many 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 hours to charge over this mm. i've had this connected for about an hour i think and we're only can we're only up to about 14 percent charge uh, if you can see that there so while you're using the device it actually takes um, a fair bit of power and there's only I think one and a half amps coming over that power cable but anyway that is uh, just a quick docking solution solution for the Lenovo Mix 210 which I'm really liking at the moment that's the Belkin USB 3 DisplayPort dock which I use with my Ultrabooks Actually, I use it with, with a lot of things now. It's it's a very, very versatile dock. It's transparent uh, it, uh, for office usage in terms of, you know, there's no delay. Um, you can run two screens off the back of a USB 3 connection and one screen off a USB 2 connection with the audio, with the gigabit Ethernet as well. So really tidy solution. Thanks to Belkin for, for lending me that. Okay, there's an unboxing of the Lenovo Mix 210 on uh, YouTube so don't forget to check that out this is just a quick video to show you how I'm using it today there'll be a full review going up on umcportal.com uh, later this week I would say so within five days of this video going up my name's Chippy I'm at, on at Chippy at Twitter so you can ask me questions there or drop comments below here don't forget to subscribe to the YouTube channel and we'll be back with a more formal video soon thanks for watching